Law of Conservation of Energy It is common for energy to be converted from one form to another. However, the law of conservation of energy, a fundamental law of physics, states that although energy can be changed in form, it can be neither created nor destroyed. The energy of the universe is constant. Another way of stating this law of chemistry is to say the total energy of an isolated system remains constant or is conserved within a given frame or reference. If a stick of dynamite explodes, for example, the chemical energy combined within the dynamite changes into kinetic energy, heat, light, and sound. If all this energy is added together, it will equal the starting chemical energy value. The conservation of energy in a physical system can be illustrated by changes in the mechanical energy of appalling bodies. Mechanical energy consists of two types of energy, as I have said earlier, the potential or stored energy, and kinetic energy, the energy of motion. As we observe in the illustration, as the body goes down, the kinetic energy increases and potential energy is decreases. While as the body goes up, the kinetic energy is yeah, uh, decreases, potential energy increases, and it moves slower. At any instant of the object, it conserves energy, meaning the total energy in the system is constant at any given point which give us with this initial potential energy plus the initial kinetic energy is equal to the final potential energy plus the final kinetic energy. In a chemical system, Energy is contained within chemical bonds. Energy is released when bonds are formed between molecules in a chemical reaction. When molecules are broken down, the energy is released. As with physical system, however, the total amount of energy at the start of a chemical reaction must equal the total amount at the end. As we observe in the illustration, the energy um, applied in the nucleus, the thought, uh, the, equip, uh, the summation of it, will be equivalent to the sum of each energy that being released after the collision. Now. So I can understand it. Can you think of other pan example of energy changing between kinetic and potential energy? Give one example and describe how energy being conserved. Make sure you don't repeat an answer. Example, playground equipment such as swing, slides, or trampoline involve these changes of mechanical energy, the conservation of potential and kinetic energy. Now, comment on your answer in this video.